Hello everyone. Today we're going to be looking at how you can use the QVCC library to find some ebooks. You can see we're on the QVCC main page. We're just going to go up here to student resources and then scroll down until we see library. This brings you to the library homepage where you can see all the ways you can get hold of us as well as our library hours. Now there's a couple of ways that you can find ebooks. You can do it the same way that you find our physical books through this box here or you can look directly under that big blue box and then you can look directly below that go past find articles and click on our find books and ebook you'll notice that this first box is for print books today we're just going to be looking at ebooks so we're going to be using this search ebooks box but i just want to point out that if we can't find what we're looking for using this box in our catalog it's always possible we might find something in these databases right here so for today we're just going to click this search without putting anything into that box which takes us directly to our catalog this is is where we're going to start typing in our search term and you can see the main reason that we came to this box is once we start typing we get a list of the possible options for us and actually this first option is the one we're looking for so once we click on that it takes us directly to our results screen it's just a little bit faster today we're going to make sure that we go over here to the left and make sure that we're only looking at books so we click on books and then apply filters and this brings us to our list of results so you can see here we have a lot of possible topics. You'll see also that all these say either online access or full text available. That means that that's an ebook. To get into the book, you're either going to click the online access or the full text available. Sometimes it'll take you directly to the book. Sometimes it'll just ask you to click this full text available at button right there. And this takes you directly to the book. You can see there's a lot of information right here. This is our title up at the top. Right under it is our author. Over here to the right, we have all of our publication information. This is what we're looking at when we need to start signing our book. You'll also see that you can either read this online or you can download the book. I do want to say when you get ready to download, you can see over here, we can only download a certain number of pages. So make sure that you've scanned through, you know exactly which pages you need to download before you start downloading anything. And we'll also see the description of the book right there. And directly under that, we have our table of contents. This is a great way to navigate through the book, just looking through to see exactly what it is that each of these are talking about and which one might be useful to us. So let's say chapter six is the one that we think is going to be most useful. We'll just click directly into that chapter and you can see over here to the left, we still have our table of contents. So if we decide that chapter six wasn't what we wanted, instead we wanted chapter two, we can go directly into that. The other way that we're going to navigate within the ebook is again over to the left, we have this search within book box. We can put a search term in there as well. And then now we can see every place within this book that that search term shows up. You can click on these and it will take you directly to the page and you'll see here that our search term is highlighted. So that's another way to help you navigate through the book quickly to find exactly what you're looking for. Now once you've found what you're looking for, we want to make sure we do what we always do, which is either download the book or in this case maybe you want to download the entire chapter. You also want to make sure that you're looking for your citation. In this particular instance it's over here where it says get citation and here we are and we can just copy and paste our citation directly into our Works Cited page, just making sure that we double check that it is copy and pasted correctly. You notice too, if you get a PDF of this particular chapter and then we open into it, you'll notice that the citation that we just had is also down here at the bottom of every page in case you forget to copy and paste it from that other spot. All of these things that I've showed you, including the search within box up here and all of the download and the citation options are gonna be available in any of our ebook databases. If you have any questions about ebooks or finding ebooks, or any of our other sources within the library, please feel free to contact the QVCC library and we'll be more than happy to help you. Have a great day. 